Okay, here we are with the uh, P36 from our friends at Ravel. We may never get, I may never get that camera working. It's okay. This is a custom mixed color from uh, from Tamiya. Hell, I'm very curious about what it was originally. Lemon yellow. Well, it's been mixed to be a very dark olive drab. Is this historic? Is there a historical explanation for that? I have no idea. No idea. I'm doing this whole uh, thing here. In order to demonstrate uh, something that I think is kind of important. If you look at the... Uh, we went from white to aluminum. It's no better. This is the uh, anti-glare panel, uh, which I decided to put on there after all. And um, you can see that there is a razor-sharp uh, line there, demarcation. And that, that's a, a strip of uh, decal. Okay, so I took the decal material, clear decal material right here, and I uh, I just painted along the uh, the edge of it with the very same paint I'm using. Let it dry, cut it with an X-Acto knife into strips, and then the strips can be applied like so. This gives us a nice clean edge. Now I'm going to paint in here with this olive drab paint and we're going to get an anti-glare panel made. That is today's mission. This is really easy to do but pretty much eliminates worries about uh, having it come out looking like it was painted with a brush because those sharp you can see those sharp edges that generally speaking get masked and sprayed They're, uh, they're doing some of the work that, uh, fortunately, I don't have to do anymore outside. So if you hear machinery, that's what it is. And there, there is our anti-glare panel. And then when it dries, it will dry glossy. I use glossy paints for these things. that okay <sighs> feels good don't it see you later